Well, good morning, CJ's Keto Kitchen family. This is CJ, and I don't know, it's about 5.23 a.m., and I am up earlier than normal, trying to start a new routine, which is exercising in the morning. I've never really been successful at that, but I'm gonna try it today. All right, so I came out and got up early, like I talked about earlier. Uh, exercise, did some band work. So far, so good. Uh, I've been a little leery about using bands from other companies. Um, I've had these exercise bands for years from the folks over at, uh, I think they just call themselves Body now, but this is from Beach Body. Um, and this is the exercise program that I started today. Uh, I made it probably halfway through, which I'm okay with. Uh, it's the first day. I did the weights specifically because I feel like I need to, I need to pack on some muscle. So anyway, first day, trying not to get hurt. So yeah. That's kind of how the morning went. All right, so this is my breakfast for today. Uh, scrambled eggs with cheese, with spinach mixed in with some bacon. Sarah cooked a couple of days ago. And then this is some keto low carb bread that we've had. So we've been trying to eat really basic keto stuff for the last two weeks. Uh, we went to Vegas, did not eat keto. I mean, we kind of gravitate toward low carb keto anyway, just because that's how we have been eating for so long. Uh, if you're new to our channel, we have been doing keto probably over eight years. Uh, we started, of course, as a diet and then kind of living as a lifestyle so for us, uh, we, you know, eventually we probably over the last, I don't know, six to eight months, we kind of started introducing back some just not low carb food. It's been okay. Nothing magical about it. Anyway, we went to Vegas, did not necessarily eat keto, just ate, enjoyed life, not worrying about anything. But we had also already decided that when we got back, we were going to be uh, pretty strict. So we actually grabbed the food list from the new Atkins diet. It's linked in the video description below. And uh, if you look at the induction phase of Atkins, it is really uh, keto. Um, so we grabbed that list. We purchased food that we needed. And yep, this is what we're doing. One of the things, um, I have a continuous glucose monitor that I wear. So it's been interesting over the last two weeks to see what has kind of thrown my glucose out of range. So I'm talking about what kind of keto, low carb stuff is throwing my glucose out of range. So this piece of bread is the first thing like that that I've had in two weeks. And I'm eating it on purpose. Not on, I like toast. Uh, we were going to put some uh, Chalk Zero jelly on it. But I said, okay, I want to just see what the bread with butter does by itself. So we'll see. Check on the monitor to see uh, if it has any effect. And this should not have any effect at all. Hey, guys. Welcome to another What We Eat on Keto video. Um... 
I am getting ready to break a fast and I've already had some coffee. I will probably have some more coffee later, but I'm getting ready to eat something and I will show you what that's going to be. So I am going to make myself a Cuban wrap. So I've got a little bit of pulled pork that I've warmed up here. And I got some mayonnaise pickles, yellow mustard, some ham lunch meat, some low carb tortillas, and I have grated some Swiss cheese. And I'm just going to put that all together and then I'm going to grill it. Um, you know, cause Cuban is usually done panini style where it's pressed and this is as close as I'm going to get. So that's what's for lunch and I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. All right, there it is. And it's crispy, juicy, pressed deliciousness. And I can't wait to dig in. Hey, it is girls day, Saturday. We're hitting the thrift stores. We've already been to one. We got clothes. We got clothes. Surprise, also, surprise. I'm in the driver's seat. Yep. I, I didn't get anything, surprise. Our resident new driver. So we're gonna go find some deals. Yes. So. Yay. Yay. No Yay deals. Yay. All right, have you found anything? No. Nope. <laughs> uh, I'm not much of a shopper. You're not much but into clothes. I do want to try to find a certain camera. All right, so. We'll keep looking. <laughs> All right, I took hungry. I took the Burger Queens to try the new cotton candy cloud. It's got some whole foam on the top. So what's the verdict? It's like ten so out of Is it? I love All right, it. good. Enjoy. I will watch you because that's a little too much cotton and candy and cloud for me. Okay, so here's the treasure tour. You got some pajama pants. All right, what did you get, Burger um, Queen? I, I got this shirt. All right, 25 cents. It's cute with a ruffle on the back. All right, I got Izzy. These pants. Okay. Right. Mm-hmm. And I got this shirt from Goodwill. Fifteen dollars. Pushing nice. it. You're pushing it. Nice. And then it I must got, be a super bougie brand. I got these. This shirt. And this shirt. Awesome. And I got those for $4. Both That's things. a very good price. Nice job. All right, here's the rest of your outfit. Yeah, I'm just talking. All right. Undo your jacket so you can show everybody your flare. Your, your Washington Huskies flare. Yes, they're short shorts. They're not for school. They're for summertime. No dress coding. All right, no dress coding. That's right. All right, good job. Okay, here's what I got. So I got this shirt that's got the tags on it. I don't know how much it was originally. I'll have to look it up. But it was $1.99. It was the sale tag. I got a pair, a pair of Capri pants. And then this one was $2, this shirt. And then I got a pair of earrings. Got those. And then I got this cute little milk glass bowl. I love little white bowls for some reason. So that's what I got. Very good score and very inexpensive. All right, so this is my lunch for today, kind of late. So this is celery sticks, some roast beef, and then some deviled eggs. That cream cheese looking stuff is a product we found at Costco. Uh, I It was like a vendor special that they had going on. Actually, it's really good. And when we looked at the macros before we purchased it, it was only like one car for probably two tablespoons. <clears throat> You're like a jeweler. This is a jeweler's loop. Yeah, so that's why it's like big fun mm. at our house. Big fun at our house. 
We sure know how to party. Yes, we do. We know how to party down. All right, so what you, what are we so excited about? So I found this bracelet in the parking lot of Dollar Tree, and it was broken. And it was actually broken at the stem. It's very, it's very dainty, so I'm not surprised. But I knew that I had some extra pieces that I could probably fix it. I always look down when I walk, which is probably not safe because I'll probably get hit by a crosstown bus. But anyway, sorry whoever lost their delicate gold bracelet in the Dollar Tree parking lot, but I was happy I found it. It's yours now. It's mine now. All right, so here is a, it's just easy to make. Yes. Here's the easy to make keto dinner. It is chicken curry with zoodles. Uh, and if you don't know what zoodles are, they are zucchini uh, that have been spiralized. And the kids have rice for themselves with the chicken curry. All right, so we are out eating dinner. And again, like we mentioned earlier in the video, we're eating really clean. So this is blackened pesto salmon. Uh, we substituted the bread for a salad with blue cheese dressing. And then we have green beans with bacon. And we have both the same thing. Okay, what is this? This is chocolate mousse. It's a Atkins induction recipe.